more affected by this than we first thought. Rachel's been investigating. It's like magic, a conjuring trick. Someone tells you they can take your money, move it around a bit, and then make it worth more than when they started. And if it's your pension we're talking about, then it's a big deal. We'd all love to wave a magic wand and make our pension bigger for when we finally retire. That's pretty much what has happened to hundreds of people around the UK. People like Des Lewis. You're not supposed to ask how magic is done, but this is one disappearing trick that's left lots of worried people, asking where their promised earnings have gone and how much their pensions are now worth. Long after that, though, both schemes hit problems. Des moved his pension to a scheme called the Henley Retirement Benefit Scheme, Chris, to one called Camita Oak. In total, they persuaded roughly 500 people to transfer around £17 million pounds worth of their pension funds. Storage pods are big business right now, but investing in them in general has caused concerns. The Financial Conduct Authority has warned that these pods aren't really suitable for most of us. They say they're unregulated, potentially high-risk investments that could be difficult to sell afterwards. All they had to do was agree to move their money to a new home. Where they were promised they'd earn much more money. Nice trick. They think I pulled it off. Told us that instead they paid the money that the pensioners had been promised to an offshore company based in Gibraltar. Possibly as much as two million pounds, along with a hefty commission. Toby Whitaker is the boss of Storefirst. 